excited for? Yeah, some idea. I'm asking if oh, I he knows how to talk. I was just wondering if I was <laughs> under... Okay. You're being detained for the purpose of a citation. Okay. For the purpose of a citation, you need to see some ID. Okay, okay so uh, our good friend is being uh, detained by the local vocabulary. By the Nazis. Same guy that was. Uh, I've never, I've never, ever experienced this in my entire life before. Growing up, born and raised in the city. So same guy that was wrongfully arrested I, last yeah, night. It's, all yeah. okay. it's yeah, everything's. Okay. Hey, 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 phone number. Refuse to answer questions. Every, every, every phone number. The same guy that was According wrongfully arrested last night is now. I that I don't really say anything from this point on. So. Okay. Is that okay? Okay. I just wanted to make sure that you don't ask me again. He's not okay with it. He hates the Constitution. He hates the ACLU. Same guy that was wrongfully arrested is now getting a ticket. So do you. I bet you hate the Constitution, too. <laughs> Big bad boy. Can't say a word. <laughs> Big for nothing, huh? Get your citation back in your ID um, how, how many citations like this have you written, officer? And do you have the demographics on that? I just want to know. Any of you guys? These are questions that are really important in my, uh, to me and from my experience being born and raised in the city of Portland. Again, I was just told that if I needed to grieve, I could do it in front of my policymaker's house and then like... Hey, what's the freedom of movement in this country? Do you guys know that I, clause of the Constitution? You know what I mean? Like, I promise yeah, not you. Not a one of them. I am, I am trained. Hey, we got a person standing out in the road down there. Why don't you go write them a fucking ticket? See, like, you know, mm -hmm. exactly, you know what I mean, Bill? Uh -huh. I know you guys are trained to, to see some kind of body language as well. Just so you know, I'm pretty much, I'm pretty aware of body language also. So. Yeah. I've got some confidence here. That, I mean, I, I, I guess, like, you guys can write me tickets to all you guys want. All Their the body language stuff, is hostile. That's that kind of, you know. Um, I guess I could... They want to gun each one of us down. go to a Gandhi stick where I get on my hands and knees or, like... I don't know where this is going, you guys. I'm just saying. <laughs> uh, I want to make clear, though, also that. Um, so, do you guys work for Adolf Hitler? That, uh, yeah. So, officer, I, I see your stance. You step back. And I want to be able to work with you guys. Um, about 14, 15 <laughs> days ago, the Oregon Supreme Court just passed a law, uh, or a uh, more defined. Uh, a part of it. So if we're going to be going on in the future, we're going to have to learn how to communicate. And that's not in their capabilities. I strongly believe so. It's 15 days old, you guys. Uh, we're coming out of 16 years of propaganda, lies, you know, just throwing that out. Mm -hmm. I would much rather see us come, actually reach some kind of social evolution as opposed to just false flagging it back into the evolution and this side's the bad side and this bad, this side's the good side. You know, because it's it's being propagated by corporate wars, weapon weapon industries that sell weapons to both sides of conflict, promote both sides of conflict. Hey, brother. And eventually, got to the point when somebody asked me what campaign I was working on, I would tell them the for the billionaire on the left. I'm just being honest with you guys right now. You know, like this is really an, open, an excessive amount of force today, and we're gonna go ahead and, and change it. I've been through this cycle many times. Hey, Kristen, we're uh, yeah, I've got the strength again to go through it. Across the this street right here. It's quiet out There's here. only so much time in this, in this world, and I don't have a pass to the VIP shelf today. I'm serious. Google it. Billionaire bug You guys will be left to fend for yourselves when the government turns its back on you guys. And I'm not under this illusion that it's ever gets to the point where I'm like knocking at the door of the, you know, that you guys don't, they, they don't have. We don't have is the state, as I recognized earlier today. You know, we or we have as a state where we use it. You know, technology to basically microwave people. It's really great stuff. I'm just throwing it out there. Check out my YouTube page. There's this hundred years of patents on, uh, on, on weather modification, all this patent stuff, and the different uses that it could possibly use for. We've been suppressing this cultural, you know, and, and it's getting, and it's getting, and it seems like the, 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 the those who define our value based on the economics are ready to see the pendulum swing again in the United States. I, I predict that there'll be a civil unrest. Well, we'll have foreign troops come in and, and teach the United States how to how to get along with the rest of the world. Hey, Eli, we're already on the verge of another I totally believe the South Korea has, was designed to fail by these same individuals. I'm just throwing that out there going to look at that.
understand, you know. But um, free energy was designed for people, not to target people on the other side of the planet by uh, military application. Just throwing it out there, you guys. This has been my ex experience. I was born in 1980. Um, you know, I was, I was growing up at a time when the when the hippies were coming of age, they had just got through the 70s. The answer to 1984 is 1776. Mm -hmm. killed. You know, drugs were being put in communities. You know, all they could worry about in the 70s was paying for their gas. And then the 80s, they had kids. 1776, boys. And all they wanted to do was just raise their kids. And then those kids were raised, and then they started talking about no more war and clean energy and some <laughs> stuff like that was really cool, you know, technology. The potential of humanity as opposed to capital only. Just throwing that out there. I was first arrested uh, at 11. Was well, where's my time, but as I was with, uh, He's in Austin. Video and cops. He's been down there for about five months. Did he move down there? No. He's coming back. And I was, I wasn't even branching you know, out. Was he's got work down there, so he's working down there. Mm -hmm. I'm a big person. I was taught very young uh, to not use that this way, you know, or, any, or not this way. But see, that's what I'm saying. I don't want to use this narrative where it's like us versus you guys. What is it? Sergeant's a child molester, <laughs> mm -hmm. and he also admitted he's a coward. How's that? He said, "Yes, I am a coward." <laughs> yeah, <laughs> on camera he said, "Yes, I am a coward." <laughs> and, and with direction, as opposed to just like you know somebody who's like just reacting you know, based on the First Amendment, you know, just fuck, 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 you know, and that just leads to mania. Really. Hey, just think the protesters come over here, they start siding off the police. Oh, call them up, call the protesters. <laughs> Or, you know, not socially, well, yeah, I guess so, oh, yeah, if I can, directed towards, a, like, like I said, the benefit of humanity as opposed to the benefit of just capital at the expense of our humanity at the end of the day. Zeke, how you? So, you are? Yes. You're being issued a citation for uh, ordinance 16.70.220. Um, at the bottom of the citations, the court date, show back court date, claim however you wish. If you wish to take care of that court, or wish to take care of the citation in any other, any other manner, put the citation over. There are several other options on the back. I'll give you my business card along with So what happens if we don't take care of it? What happens? Uh, that's up to the court. Hmm. Right? It's not business card too. Is that also my What did you write? Violation. How many, how, many, how many violations have you written? Like, so, Eli, as of right now, you're good, though. Officer Bernard, I'm just for the record, you guys. Trying to make that clear. I was wondering also, Officer Bernard being from the city of Portland. Just throwing out there, I was 11 years old, initiated false complaint, phone call, right to the system state. So that's why I asked these questions. That's why I'm here today. For each one of you. Unfortunately, you're legally crossing right now. This is a legal crossing? That is a legal crossing. It's a 90 degree angle. So this right here is illegal. And a 45 ticket. Yep. Hey, Pardo, come here. Billy, come back here. Say it again. God damn. <laughs> These fucking faggots. These faggots really want to wear tickets. <laughs> so what happens if I cross like this? Do I get a ticket? Hello, answer me. Public servant. Fuck it. <laughs> these faggots are incapable of talking. <laughs> One of these are fucking bitches. I think I'm going to have fun with each one of their moms tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
<laughs> Did you hear what he said? Tell him he's going. Last time they were up here, there was dance parties in the street. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, it is. Are all these cops this stupid, Bob? The, uh, that they don't even know what double jeopardy is? You can't be charged for the same crime twice. You can't be tried for the same cop crime twice. To the point now where, well, you know, they're working What's with... folks, Muhammad, West Coast Auditors. I mean, it's insane. I mean, maybe that is the way it is, you know. It's like, you know, if you can't afford a bottle of water, you don't drink. And, and we just succumb to this belief that we're just going to you know, be able to live our lives without the need for anything. And we just don't think about the fact that the people are just going to be in the and possible real, literal, uh, geopolitical, uh, economic shifts, pendulum swings. Again, like I was saying, that leads to um, real heavy Oh, and stuff. just for the record, this is an e-cig, this is not Islands a weapon. being built in the Pacific Ocean, heavy kind of stuff. You know, this is a military an e -cig, not a weapon, being guys. in one specific, specific area so surrounded by the <laughs> quote-unquote enemy. Damn, you know, and, and, and at the end of the day, those all those guys, you know, all you know, you know, you know, maybe not. I mean, maybe they use drug money to kill each other. <laughs> to these guys, we are the enemy because we believe in the Constitution. Right now. To these guys, we all believe that these guys are the influence of many, many years of social engineering. That's what I and and money. I guarantee you not a one of them can tell you the First Amendment of the Constitution. I guarantee they cannot paraphrase it. The only way I'm leaving here is in the Navy unless I have a fucking diabetic. Keep my blood sugar up. That happens to call him. That's all the things that you probably think we should have lack of information that we have been blessed to have during the free shooting in the back. Access information to all four corners of the world does not get That's what Nazis do. I'd more trust these guys to call me. Do this again. Yeah, well, Bob, you have a, a candy bar or energy drink in the car? Yeah, I got something. Can I get a, can I get something? Yeah. Do I need to do it again to prove the point? Because we've already been out here now for how much have we cost the taxpayers? <laughs> As of now, I'm just wondering. I mean, if I do it again, then I justify you guys being out here you know, revenue. So, these are the citations, exact same citation as the last one. Uh, are, why don't you explain to me, Robinson? You're so, the so I, I'm, I'm the one talking. that's issuing the citation. Uh, he asked you. Well, Eli, Eli, talk in a Eli, I'm the one issuing the citation. Shut your mouth, Robinson. <laughs> Shit. Okay. Point, Robinson. I think you've heard me. And you know where we're coming from. Eli, are you ready to listen to the citation? 
You it's better gonna, know. It's going to be the same citation. That's my information for you. It's going to be the same citation the last time. Uh, ordinance 16.7. Robinson zero needs zero to learn how to shut his mouth. Right I don't want you to be uh, used for the wrong reasons. Your citation, your court date's at the bottom. Show up to that court date, plead however you wish. We should take care of that citation in any other manner. Flip that citation over. There's several options on the back. Oh, he's littering. So write him a ticket. Here's your here's your citation. African American officer out of the mall will Here's your ID. The, the officer here littered. Here Let's write him a ticket. My my business card. And my partner's business card. And um, right now you're free to go, Eli. All right, can um, I get you uh, to give me your ticket book so I can write you a citation for littering? Huh, Westerland? <laughs> can I, write I you don't a want to justify your guys' existence any further. 